So today, really quick, as you can see, I posted videos of Georgia's eye appointment today. Um, however, it took me six months to get into this place because they do specialize in helping autistic kids and things like that. However, um, once we were at the appointment, um, they wanted to dilate Georgia's eyes, um, which I knew she wouldn't wait that long for it to um, take effect, which is like 35, 40 minutes. She was already ready to go to school. Option was to get the drops later, come back another day, um, put them in before her appointment so they could just keep it moving. Um, so my problem lies with the receptionist. When I went to reschedule the appointment, um, she wanted to schedule me three months out. And I said, I waited six months to get in. I'm not going to wait another three months. Is there a cancellation list that you can put me on? She told me, y'all, here's the part. We're in high-end doctor's office. We're busy. And I said, so you mean to tell me you don't have a cancellation list? And she said, again, we're a high-end doctor's office. I don't have time to be calling patients about a cancellation. Okay, so I took Georgia to the car, got her settled, and I called back. And I told this young lady, I don't care about your high-end doctor's office. I need to speak with your doctor or your manager to let them know the words you use with me, first of all. And second of all, they would not be happy that you are not taking care of me the way they told me I would be taken care of. Georgia's next appointment is this Friday. Why it's important that we speak up no matter who it is, how we feel matters. I just wanted to share that with you guys um, to speak up, don't give up, um, and be your child's voice because what we want and how we feel matters. All right, guys. Bye.